Hi, I'm Mike Byers for TimesOnline.com. We're here at the University of Pittsburgh's Peterson Event Center where Beaver Falls just lost the Whippeal AAA Championship game to Indiana 62-61. It was a thriller, but at the very end, the Little Indians pulled it off by scoring with 1.5 seconds left in the game. And as you saw, Josh made a good poke the ball. The ball was loose. Uh, if we had been a little bit quicker to get to it, then we might have gotten the steal. And then, you know, once he gathered the ball, when we our momentum was going after that steal, it was very difficult for us to recover and get back and help. And that's inevitably what happened. They dumped it down to where our help left, and they got a long, basically a wide open layup. Well, they really shot the ball well in the first half, uh, and they shot the ball well in the second half too. But nothing like they did in the first half. Uh, so we just made a we made a, a substitution that I thought could help. I thought putting Duffy in for Leak. Uh, might help us because there's now two really good shooters out on the floor. Might stretch their defense a little bit. And once we got a couple stops strung together, then we got our composure and we made a nice little run. I mean, we had a nine-point lead very late in the game. Josh was a monster tonight. Uh, he 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 played his best game of the year in his biggest game of the year. So I was very proud of his effort. Josh is Josh is coming along. He came a long way this year uh, as a young man, and I, I was very proud to see that effort. I, I would have liked to have seen what happened in the winning effort, but that's just part of it. You know, we've won a lot of games like we just lost this one, so the law of averages we finally catch up. Against. Well, I, I told our guys that you know they were part of a really good game. It hurts because it's supposed to. Uh, but they have to be very careful because if they think about this game too much and if they pout about this game too much, then they'll walk into a game on Friday that they will lose. Uh, you have to be able to put some adversity behind you, and you know it's a teachable moment right now. Um, you know the WPIL is fantastic, but it's not the ultimate goal. The ultimate goal is the state championship, and uh, this is just a bump in the road. And we'll see if our kids have the resiliency that I hope they have. But I was pretty proud of the way this group of, of really young players performed in this in this WPIL tournament and hopefully we could do the same in the states. But Beaver Falls' bid to win their 10th championship in school history didn't work out tonight, but the season is not over. The Tigers play next Friday in the state championship tournament, first round game against Meadville. Both teams are 23 and 3. Should be a great basketball game, site to be determined. I'm Mike Byers for TimesOnline.com.